which of the following best completes the passage? Uh, some 70% of consumers polled at an upscale supermarket said that they did not care for the taste of Apex toothpaste. Nonetheless, nonetheless, sales of Apex accounted for a full 75% of toothpaste sold at that supermarket. The conclusion that at least 75% of shoppers buying toothpaste did in fact enjoy the taste of Apex toothpaste relies on the assumption that. So, 70% um, said they didn't like it but 75% of the toothpaste sales are the thing that people um, said they didn't like. So either, um, so if we conclude that actually 75% actually do like it, that must mean, well, what? Let's see which of these makes the most sense. A, most of the shoppers polled did not make any toothpaste purchases that day. Um, uh, it's 75% of the toothpaste sold at that supermarket in general, not just on that day, so this isn't it. Uh, B, most shoppers who bought Apex did so because of its proven efficacy in fighting tooth decay. There's no evidence for that. That's certainly not an assumption. Um, C, nearly every shopper who bought Apex did so because he or she did not like its taste. Um, it definitely doesn't rely on that assumption because um, the, the conclusion is that 75% did in fact enjoy the taste. We are not assuming that they didn't like it. Uh, D, a large number of shoppers polled were dental professionals. That's not very likely. Or E, shoppers will not buy a certain brand of toothpaste if they do not care for its taste. So if we're concluding that the 75% who bought Apex toothpaste bought it because they enjoy the taste, we have to, we absolutely must assume that people don't buy it if they don't like the taste. It must be choice E.